Why should the people in the building be in fear of their life? Scary situation for a North Portland neighborhood where a barricaded suspect accused of shooting off a gun multiple times before lighting an intense fire to a high rise apartment balcony. That scene unfolding earlier this evening in North Portland, all before he was taken into custody. At 10 o'clock, I'm Jeff Gianola. And I'm Elizabeth Din. Our Jamie Seymour has been at this scene all day going into the evening. It's near Cathedral Park. Let's get to Jamie now. You checked in with neighbors about this chaotic situation. What's the latest? Well, you know, this is about five hours after that fire first broke out, and you can still smell the smoke in the air. But things have considerably calmed down here. But this scene was constantly escalating all afternoon, and neighbors said they were terrified, not knowing what was going to happen next. Flames erupting from an eighth floor balcony just hours after reports of someone throwing furniture up that balcony and later gunshots fired from within a constantly escalating nightmare for neighbors. My wife is inside and, and uh, I'm just, you know, I'm concerned. It's, uh, it sounds like it's pretty scary. Portland police were first called to the Shrunk Riverview Tower Apartments near the Cathedral Park neighborhood early Friday afternoon. When North Precinct officers were dispatched to a report of someone throwing uh, items, including furniture items, out of a balcony. Police say the suspect was reportedly in a mental health crisis. Things quickly escalated when they knocked on his door, saying he answered with a rifle, then closed the door on them. A short time later, officers began reporting hearing shots fired from within the apartment. While they don't believe any shots were actually fired out of the apartment into the neighborhood, many officers were called to close off the surrounding area, even evacuating some apartments and issuing a shelter in place for the surrounding neighborhood. Anytime we approach a situation like this where we have somebody who's armed, we always want to proceed as slowly and carefully as possible. PPB says the suspect then began to light items on fire on the balcony shortly before he was taken into custody just before five. But the fire quickly engulfed the entire balcony and started to spread inside, sending a plume of thick smoke up and damaging other apartments. A fire station just one block away quickly got into gear. Ladders and tables and chairs, you know, mental state. People have mental problems. Deborah Harris has lived in the tower for more than 20 years and says her husband was inside when the fire started. Says more should have been done to help the suspect when he first started experiencing any distress before things escalated. It should have been done yesterday. People on oxygen in there. There's my husband's on oxygen. Following his arrest, the suspect was taken to a local hospital as a precaution, but he was not injured. He is now detained as police investigate. PPP is not releasing his name at this time. Reporting live in North Portland, Jamie Seymour, Coin Six News.